Hey guys, before the video begins, I just wanted to share a quick message with you. Well, two things. One, I know Donald and Douglas got the most votes, but I've really wanted to do an Oliver error for the longest time. That's why I'm doing Oliver now. And two, this is an experimental error. I wanted to try something new in the error community. And this is basically the first of its kind, or at least to my knowledge. But anyway, this could either go really well or really poorly. If it goes really poorly, I'll never do this again. But if it goes really well, then I'll make more videos like this. But yeah, without further ado, let's get on with the video. This is the Experimental Oliver Error. Ugh, now what? What am I facing off against this time? We interrupt your computer session for a... Oliver error. Oliver was killed Good by... Good God, just stop rambling, put the timer and the chances down, and then just go away so we can get this over with! Alright, alright, jeez. Let me just put the timer on, damn. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the shed this morning. As for you, you have five hours and ten chances. And basically, you know what to do. Just turn off the computer and I'll just get right into my evil mode. Just do it. Whoa, Oliver, calm down. What's with the temper? <sighs> I'm sorry. It's just... I just get very annoyed when every error ends up being the same way. The user turns off the computer, the error gets mad, goes into his evil mode, and then forces the person to enter the code. A lot of times, the person gets the code wrong, and then the error ends up jump-scaring them. You know, I'm just... It's just... I'm really sick of it, you know? But if it's for the sake of the video, just... Get it over with and just turn your computer off ten times so I can get back to my nice and cozy shed, please. I know exactly how you feel, Oliver. Do you think I like having to constantly turn off the computer just because of some stupid error? Do you think I like trying other methods like blocking the computer, restarting the computer, putting the computer on standby, or even going as far as breaking the computer screen just to try and get rid of the error? Do you think I like having my other electronics blocked just because I have to watch a stupid error? And most of all, do you think I like having to spend thousands of dollars buying a new computer just because I got the code wrong and the error ended up destroying the computer? Do you think I like that? No, I don't like that. I really hate that. So you know what? I'm just going to wait the five hours and see what happens. I mean, it's not that long. Well, I know your type. Deep down inside, you want to turn off your computer so badly. So, I'm not going to hold a grudge if you do. However, that does not mean that I don't trust you. I will give you a fair trial and we'll see what happens. Okay, and trust me, Oliver, you will not be disappointed. The timer starts now. Okay, it's time to make Oliver proud. I am going to wait the five hours just to see what would happen. One hour later. Wow. You've gone one hour without turning your computer off. I have to say, I'm very surprised. But there's still four hours for you to screw up, so I'm not keeping my hopes up. You know what? To keep myself busy, I'm just gonna sing myself a little song. I hope you don't mind, Oliver. She
Oliver, are you crying? No, I don't cry, I'm British. It's just, that singing voice was absolutely beautiful. Have you ever thought of being an American Idol? Oh, no, 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 my, my singing voice isn't that great. Well, to me, it has potential. Just for that beautiful singing voice, I have decided to give you five extra chances. You now have a total of 15 chances. What? Wow, you think my singing's that good? Um, thank you, Oliver, I really appreciate that. Okay, yes, I do cry. Duck laughs at me about it, but I just can't help it, you know, I get very emotional. It's okay to cry sometimes, Oliver. I cry sometimes, too, when I'm really depressed. It, it helps me feel better about myself to cry, you know, because, you see, I'm not like most other men. You see, I, too, am very emotional, and both my dad and my brother laugh at me about it, but I'm just trying to express my emotions, you know, and it's really... It's a really tough world, you know what I'm saying? They raise us men to be these tough and strong people, and basically whenever we cry, they tell us, Oh, grow up! You know? Like, it's okay for a grown man to cry, you know? Just moderate the crying, that's all. You are absolutely right. And you should really consider going to American Idol. I mean, that, that was just beautiful. You know what, Oliver? You're not like the other errors. You seem really nice. And, you know, I really want to be your friend. You know, you seem really friendly, really kind, and, you know, I just... I just want to have a conversation with you right now. Two hours later. So there Toad and I were, face to face with death itself, as we were about to be scrapped. Oh my god! Then what happened?! Then Douglas came along and rescued us. We were stopped by a foreman, but we had to make it seem like Douglas was taking us in for scrap, so then he would let us go. He then snuck us out of the mainland and took us back to Sodor, and now we are a working member of Sir Topham Hatt's Railway. Wow, that story was scary and inspiring at the same time. Makes me want to make a story of my own about that. Oh, did I tell you the story about Scruffy? It's a really good one. No, you haven't. Please tell me. Before I do, I just want to say thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me. I really appreciate it. As a gift to you, I've decided to give you another five extra chances, bringing you up to a total of 20 chances. You know, Oliver, I feel the same exact way. I feel really good talking to you. I feel like I could talk to you about anything and you would listen. You're just a really cool friend to hang out with. Well, I'm really glad you consider me a friend. I appreciate that. Now, about Scruffy. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one! Yeah! Wow, I'm impressed. You went the entire five hours and you never turned off your computer once. I'm really impressed. Okay, now that I've waited the five hours, may I have my session back, please? You can have your session back very soon. But first, you need to answer this very simple question. I have to answer a question? So basically, I had to enter a code regardless if I waited or not. So, there's no guarantee I'll get my session back. Well, if you get the question correct, then I will give you your session back. But if you don't, then I will have no choice but to... What, destroy my computer? No, not completely destroy it. I was thinking I would temporarily ban you from using your computer if you get it wrong. You've been nothing but nice to me, and it's the least I could do. But anyway, the question is, 
What is the name of my faithful brake van? I will give you a clue. I mentioned him earlier. Type the answer down below if you think you know it. You know, I'm actually happy to answer this question because, you know, you've been really nice to me and it's the least I could do. There you go. That's the answer. Okay, it's checking the answer right now. I really hope it's right. You, sir, truly are an amazing person. You got the answer correct. It is Toad. As your reward, you may now have your session back. Wow, okay, I got it correct. I knew it was right. But yeah, thank you so much for keeping me company, Oliver, for the past five hours. I was really entertained, you know? We should do this more often. I totally agree. We definitely should. But in the meantime, I must go now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thanks for the fun five hours. <sighs> what a nice engine. Oh, and also, guys, thank you all so much for watching this experimental error video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. So long. It was at this moment that he knew. He was screwed.